You know how those YouTubers, they have that fancy arm that swings in and they can adjust it with the microphone on it. If you could see the thing that I made, you would be like, that guy is, a, is an evil genius mad scientist. <laughs> it's pretty much PVC uh, pipe, plastic piping, uh, rigged up to a uh like a tripod stand that i had for like curtains and like drapes and stuff like that for like backgrounds of photo taking because i have in a former life i i did photography and i have all this photography stuff uh and then anyway i rigged up the the microphone it comes with a little stand that you're supposed to attach to you know like uh, an arm a swing arm or whatever that would hold your microphone but it's too heavy like the microphone when it's on there so i needed to counterbalance it on the other side it's the most god-awful thing you've ever seen but you'd be like wow that's ingenuity right there <laughs> that is ingenuity how that this this has been made it is uh it is uh pretty awesome and also horrendous at the same time i'll have to take a picture and post it on twitter after uh anyway seeing if uh let's see if we fetch any more fishes to come watch our live stream here rio heroes rio heroes uh okay no one's liked it yet i got two watching so hopefully the we'll wait for a little bit here and get the get some notifications uh gotta start it soon though because i have to uh probably can't finish this rio heroes one through four until the end probably go around till uh, about the last fight before the last fight because i'll have to i'll have to uh, skedaddle at around 10 o'clock my time so it's 8 20 right now anyway we'll uh why don't we just get going now and just wait for other people to get in Let's go. Here we go. Rio heroes. These are the heroes of Rio. <laughs> Fighting out in a park somewhere <laughs> on some mats in the middle of a street. They've closed down traffic. No, I don't think they closed down traffic. They probably didn't. Oh, let me know. Uh, can you guys hear the, the video last time? Nobody told me, but the video was too low for the last stream and nobody mentioned it. I would have gladly turned up the audio on the video. But can you hear the screaming Portuguese here? Here we go. We got our two male aggressors. The guy with his jock strap showing. Oh, bare fisted punches. Oh, they're out of bounds. <laughs> out of bounds. They got a really short area to fight on. If you go out of bounds. Oops, he hurt himself. Did he? Is that it? What's happening, ref? Get some control here. What is he? All right. He hurt his nose. Uh, go to a, a neutral corner. <laughs> they have they have neutral corners on the fucking mat. Uh oh, bring in the doctor. This is enough. Uh, nope, they don't need it. <laughs> oh, you guys did mention it a couple times. I'm sorry. I I never noticed. It. Maybe because I had I didn't have the live chat on. I had the top chat on. So it was filtering out all you guys is telling me that it was too low. So anyway, I oh, I think that had to hurt. Them, them mat, I'm telling you, those mats don't have a lot of padding on them. I've wrestled on mats like that. They're really not that good. Oh, oh, he's uh, he taps out, tapped out. There you go. That's your first, that's your first fight of. <laughs> that's the first fight of real heroes. That guy got starched, and he wore a fucking speedo. Neutral corner. What, are they gonna fight more? He tapped out. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> Go to your neutral corner while I announce him. <laughs> Say something to the, uh, the adoring fans at home. He pounded him. He said, I pound you. <laughs> oh my god. Here we go, is the second fight of Rio Heroes, more heroes. Kaiko Raka. Oh, leg kick. He shoots in. He gets a body lock, takes him down. 
Yeah, uh, so I kind of ruined the last stream because it was too low and you couldn't hear the shit, so I apologize for that. It's, that kind of makes me sad because it was a good stream. <laughs> and the, the shit talking of the Gilbert Ivel uh, uh, other guy, I forget his name. <laughs> that was sort of lost. Oh boy. Who's he going for? He's gonna set up an arm bar maybe? He's sitting, he's ready for an arm bar. You gonna try a triangle now from the top. Well he's kinda got the triangle locked in, now he's switching to an arm bar. He taps out. There you go, that's your second fight of Rio Heroes. This is uh, really an amazing promotion. I can't understand why it no longer exists. There you go. Oh yeah, <laughs> look at this fucking clown, this referee. <laughs> the she-male, do you see the she-male in the back there? I haven't spotted the she-male yet. Okay. Here we go. More fighting from Heroes of Rio. This is great stuff. This really is awesome. <laughs> oh, leg kick. That's a good leg kick. Oh, he comes super quick with them punches. Oh, goes for a high kick. Oh, he nearly got capitalized. <laughs> so apparently there's a she-male. I don't know if they, the she-male fights on this one. Uh, or if it's one of the other Rio here. Oh, he fell. Get him. Axe kicks. What are the rules here? Can he kick the head? Oh, he's going crazy with his legs. Yeah, it is pretty obscure stuff. Uh, it's pretty recent. I want to say it was middle of uh, the decade, 2000, maybe late, like 2008, 2009. That must be fight in Brazil <laughs> or Portuguese. <laughs> Oh man. So they're like fighting in some backwater. Oh, he oh, but he's out in the square. He's in the square. Does he lose a point for that? Oh, he's got to make sure he get grip. Go Bachi. This guy's a kicker. He's got uh, flames on his trunks. Oh, that's a good high kick. That's pretty snappy. Oh, they both go for push kicks there. Kind of collide. He's working on some punches. Oh, he shoots in. Oh, nice. Oh, but he loses it. He loses it. Nope, he still manages to stay on here. Got to make sure you fight within a six-foot square. <laughs> you can't go outside the six-foot square. Uh, he's working to get his hooks in. There he goes. Got to flatten him out here. He punches the shoulder. Should punch the head instead of the shoulder. You should punch underneath the armpits through the Igor Volchanchin. Punch under the armpits. But maybe he doesn't want to punch him in the head. He doesn't really want to inflict pain on the guy. He doesn't want to hurt his own hands. This is the longest fight so far of Rio Heroes. He's going for a choke. Oh, he's getting him. Uh, he's got it. Tap out. There we go. Three fights down. Three quick fights. This is, uh, I don't understand how they could consider this. Umberto one. This guy, he's going places. He's about 40 years old, but he's going places. <laughs> Yeah, I, the place I used to, well, uh, the dojo I used to train at, the kickboxing dojo, they had mats like that, but they were like multicolored. But yeah, they're the same things you get at, for kids for Walmart, but these, I guess, are slightly, uh, they're, about, they're about the same thickness. So we have more fights, more fighting happening now. Look at the guy over there, and this guy, I've been watching this guy, back here. This guy. What's up with him? 
Look at this guy. He's just here to watch. Is he like the president of Rio Heroes? <laughs> so that's the president. That's uh, like the chief operating executive. <laughs> the C, uh, you know, he's a chief, uh, whatever, whatever. Fucking name he's, uh, this guy's in uh, marketing. Uh, this guy's in promotion. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, he's punching him in the head. Little hammer fists. So I'd love to know what the rules are. What is allowed, not allowed. Oh, he's got mount. He's got mount and he's going to start going crazy here. He should. Uh-oh, he's, oh, he's switched to the back. And he's going to flatten him out. He's trying to flatten him out. He's going to go for something here just to control the arm. Uh, punching under the... Up, oh, he can't punch under the armpit. What happened? Oh, is a ref stand up? He had a back mount. <coughs> what the <coughs> fuck was that? He had back mount, and you do a ref stand up on that? Jeez, how much more violent do you want it to get there, ref? So this guy here, the uh, in his uh, vice or the just regular shorts. Uh, this guy in board shorts. <laughs> this is hi Joey. This is Rio Heroes. Rio Heroes one through four. They condensed four events in, <laughs> into one video file here. <laughs> I th actually I think you, you might think it was from the. Is it from the late nineties? Uh, B Woods plays. I think I thought it was from like two thousand eight. I could be wrong. Well, that was a good lace. Uh, leg kick there. That was a good inside leg kick. He's, this guy's got some skill. Uh, this guy definitely uh, has this guy kind of outclassed. I see this guy uh, taking this fight easy. But that's just my prediction. Oh, that was a stiff leg kick there. He's got a body lock. The, this guy. Oh, he tries to take him down. Oh, he need him right in the face. Oh, now he's going for a sort of bitch fists. He gets into side control. He knees. Oh, this guy has got an earring. Why did you not take your earring out, buddy? You're going to, uh, your, your ear. Luckily, it's not a loop. So I wonder if you're fighting it. <laughs> oh, he jumps in the mount there. He's going for an arm bar. I think. No, he's just beating the shit out of him. So, oh, he, little punches under the armpit. This guy's done, ref. Stop it. Ref, stop the fight. <laughs> Okay, whatever that guy said. He beat the fuck out of him, this guy. So this guy had his earring. I don't see it anymore. I wonder if it... No, it's still there. What would be funny is if a guy had a ear hole like Jeff Hardy, would it be legal to, like, attack that? Like, can you attack the ears? Uh, the ear hole? Or would that be considered, like, uh, fish hooking? This guy, unfortunately, this guy's like in his mid 30s. Either that or everybody, all Brazilian males look about 10 years older than they actually are. <laughs> so, oh, uh, is this a. Didn't we see this guy with the flames? Is this a tournament? Is that what this is? A tournament? This guy's fighting again? Whoa, did you see that uh, question mark kick there? Little. Ooh, look at that uh, far flung jab there. <laughs> So we got a guy in the flame shorts with Vulcan. It says Vulcan on the side there. Whoa, this guy's just sparring. This guy's not like really fighting here. That was a good leg kick though. Ow, that hurt. He felt that one. He did not like that. You, uh, you, this is, uh, if that happened in a pro fight, you, you don't do that. You don't let somebody know it hurts, but I guess that guy couldn't help it. Look at this guy. Whoa, stop. <laughs> This guy is just throwing fucking combos here at nothing. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? Is this guy in a real fight? Is this real fighting or is this just like sparring? This is like a sparring session. Because that's what you do to yourself in the mirror. What this guy does here. Let's go back and see this. This is a fucking amazing combo. Whoa. Oh, this is uh, not. This is. I went back too far, but that's okay. Oh, he gets him with that leg kick. Oh, that was a good leg kick, though. That was like right behind the knee. Hit him on the tendon. Now watch this. 
this is the air combo here. It's like he's Streets of Rage. He's Alex from Streets of Rage. Or is it Alec? Ooh, whoo. He's still going. <laughs> he's a fucking, oh my God. That was fucking tremendous. <laughs> yeah, he is mashing buttons in a fighting game. <laughs> he just didn't stop. He just kept going. <laughs> Go Bachi! I'm gonna make this video a little bit bigger here. Let's make it as big as we can. Oh, it's too big. We got black spots. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that combo was pretty awesome. Whoa! Get back on the mat. Go Bachi! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that is funny. Oh my god. I love listening to Portuguese, it's great. That's too big for the chat. Oh, and I'm hiding. <laughs> I've been hiding the fucking logo. What's happening, ref? What is this guy doing? Why is this guy so close? What are they there to keep him from going outside of the fucking mats? What's this guy doing back here? Look at this guy. And they, they got their cell phone cameras or flip phone cameras. Wait. I, I have to point this out. These guys have fucking flip phone cameras. This guy got a flip phone on his belt buckle. This guy, I think, which we established was like the president of Rio Heroes. The awesome MMA promotion. You might say the flip phone dates this, vi uh, this fighting promotion to like the early 2000s but we're, this is Brazil we're talking about I think they still have flip phones there today yeah. is that a Joe San over there <laughs> yeah time travelers that's right like the, the meme the fucking uh, guy in the, the 1920s photo that's like a hipster he's got a camera oh he's attacking that leg oh he chopped him down that's it he's done he fucked that leg up. He's like, are you all right, buddy? I'm sorry I beat your knee up. Oh, this is sweet. What a nice guy, though. That's pretty sweet. You know? Unfortunately, he doesn't know his own strength. Where did he get that fucking... He actually looks like my brother-in-law. <laughs> yes. All right. Great. Here we go. More fighting. It's getting late in the day in Brazil. It's still balmy, 80 degrees probably at you know 6 p.m. <laughs> yeah. So this does move to. I call. It, so hey, Port Film. Uh, I right now. The change of venue will happen. It, it starts out in the open mat out in the rural area of fucking Rio de Janeiro. It will eventually move into the interiors. <laughs> I, I liken it to a prison because one of them looks like a prison. <laughs> like they're fighting in a prison. Anyway. Oh, he kicks them. This, these are not like official fight gear. That guy's just got like uh, beach board shorts on. This guy has, I guess, fighting trunks, but again, those are like swim trunks. They're all wearing swim trunks. Ooh, this guy. I think we're seeing... What the fuck is happening? What was that? Is that legal? <laughs> is that Was that legal? This fucking guy. I'm going to rewind it here if I, if I can do the re This fucking guy, like a bystander, just <laughs> comes in and shoves him. What are you getting involved for? <laughs> it probably is outside a local elementary. It's like get get in there. <laughs> what was that all about? Oh, good leg kick. These guys got some good leg kicks. These guys got some skills. You, uh, Dana White should have been watching this. Uh, I see some skills in these guys. Oh, that's, that's some good. That's some hard punches there from this guy in fucking uh, the gray bluish, bluish gray. Oh, they see that question mark kick? Oh, wow, these boys are starting to get into it. They're fucking ready to throw down. You can see the... I've seen and I, I've seen this in uh, at the dojo before. 
you can tell when guys are tensing up and they're starting to, you know, they're, I don't know if you call it not their emotion, they're like, or they're, they're just, uh, their fighting senses start taking over and they start to like tense up. And you see, I see that. I've seen this happen in the gym. These guys are fucking ready to explode on each other. Uh, they're really tense. Uh, anyway. Oh, I heard him. <laughs> I didn't. I. I'm, I didn't mean to stroke the cursor on the guy's buttocks. I'm just. I need a bigger cursor. Uh, I actually had made a custom cursor. It's like a finger, like a, a finger pointing. Uh, but I didn't install it. I say the body language, just the way they're the, when they were standing up there. It's like you could tell that they were hurting each other or they were feeling each other's punches. So you could tell they're like, you know, they were getting freaked out kind of i guess you could call it like freaking out a little bit like they're getting uh fight or flight sense is taken over to where they're it's no longer just like a sparring i've seen it before in the dojo kobachi little body shot there Ooh. look at this fucking om ominous fellow he's like get the cameraman's like get out of the fucking way why is why was that guy getting so close anyway? Oh, that's a good leg kick. Yeah, this guy's got some good kicks. Whoa, spinning back kick. That's pretty slick. A good form on that. This guy's got some. Uh, he's got some good uh, Muay Thai martial arts. Nice. That was yeah, I would liken it to that. It's. Oh, he's chopping him down with these leg kicks. He's doing really good. Oh, he shoots in there. Oh, they're on the field. Nope, you can't fight on that little square. You gotta fight on the other square. Is that a doctor back there? What the fuck was that? Now the guys in the fucking crowd are starting to get hyped up. They're wanting to fight now, too. <laughs> Oh, well, them white kicks just keep coming. What is this guy doing? This guy, <laughs> this guy was ready to fight. He took a, up a fighting stance. This fucking guy. I, I'm just gonna put it back to the frame. This guy took up a fighting stance. <laughs> He's ready to fucking go right here. <laughs> Look at this guy. Oh boy, this is great. <laughs> Alright, take some down. <laughs> yeah, Takata's, uh, the, I have the secret file footage from Takata. Oh, he's punching him in the back. Just in the back. Oh, he turns him over. Nice little reversal there. Oh, he's going for a triangle. Nope. What the fuck is this guy doing? What's happening? What, the ref stand up? What? This is the second, like, nonsensical stand up they've had I don't know if they don't want the guys fighting on the ground at all but the first stand up uh, from one of the previous fights the guy had his back like he had a back mount and the ref comes in and stand him up right there the guy just reversed it and he was ready to do some damage and and they fucking I don't know what's going on this guy is this guy gonna fight <laughs> fucking he's got a green polo on um, Oh, Gobachi. A little raging knee there. Oh, he's killing him with them leg kicks. He's killing him with those leg kicks. There he shoots in again, takes him down. <laughs> I don't know what those guys are snickering at. He's got a bloody mouth, it looks like. The guy in the... Oh, he, it's on top. There we go. He's going to punch him out now. <laughs> 90s Quebec school yard fighting. I'll have to take your word for it. Is he going to choke him out here? Oh, oh. Come on. You can hit harder than that. Hit him. Oh, he's, happening. he's ready to go. There you go. Oh, it's a brotherhood. This is like Fight Club in Rio. Yeah. He gets his arm raised as if this is a real fucking promotion. He looks like one of my brother-in-laws too. 
Uh, oh, here we go. Well, now we're moved to the inside. Okay, so this guy's in his fucking Hanes uh, long boxers, uh, tidy whitey shorts. Uh, we've got a new judge here. His shirt says, or a new referee. His shirt says, no rules. This at least looks like it's uh, some type of training facility. Or maybe it's a call center. I see some uh, women back here. Uh, anyway, let's see what happens here. Okay, no rules. This is not a good stance. What is this guy doing? As a defensive stance, this is good. That's good, I guess. But that's only if you're using your your hand here to deflect the strikes. Oh, that was stiff as fucking hell. That was one of the stiffest looking straights I've ever seen in my life. Uh, this guy. Uh, he might be a boxer in training or like he, he might be learning. <laughs> it's just coming backwards. It looks even worse. <laughs> he might be uh, learning to, uh, the throw punches. Yeah, it does. Uh, Joey, it does remind me of, uh, of pit fighter too. Here we go. Watch his straight here. That uh, was not fucking. <laughs> uh, bug Beto, This is. Let me pop <laughs> this fucking guy over here. That, I don't know what this guy's fucking problem is. This is uh, Rio Heroes one through four. Uh, it's nonstop fighting, all all submissions, all knockouts. Uh, there's the fights don't last more than a couple minutes. <laughs> so we've got a lot of fights packed in here. This fucking guy on the ground. He's like spastic. Oh, that axe kick right to the dick. Oh, he's falling. Oh God. Let's go. He's ready to fight. They gotta fix the mat. The mat is fucked up. What is his stance? What is he supposed to be doing? Ooh. Uh, oh, he goes in for a slap and he didn't like that. He got countered there. His straights are horrible. The pale guy, his in the gray trunks. He does not know how to throw a straight punch. Whoa, a flying capoeira kick there. It is Brazilian as fuck. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? So this guy, uh, the black fellow, and uh, oh, he got kicked in the fucking belly there. Oh, that was a good shot. Oh, that was a terrible shot. Oh, he, this guy. Oh, he broke, <laughs> he broke the fucking window. <laughs> what the fuck happened here? <laughs> Oh my god, he's, he's got glass shattered on him. He's John McClain, and the doctor's in there. Oh my god. Oh, sweet Jesus. Uh, shit's gotta ride. <laughs> They're suddenly realizing uh, this was a bad idea. <laughs> They've got these flimsy ass glass. I, I didn't want to comment on the construction of this little area they're in. It looks like it's cheap as fuck. <laughs> let's, let's instant replay this. Let's uh, go back here. <laughs> the doctor's in to check and make sure he hasn't been fucking uh, <laughs> seriously injured here. Uh, <laughs> and he's walking away victorious right here. He's like, yeah, <laughs> I, just, I just kicked his ass. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, the reaction of the guy he tries to grab. Is he trying to grab the glass? As I rewind here. <laughs> uh, I don't know if they, they're, uh, what happens if he helps push the window out. Because this guy has got his hands like he's a child at, a, at like a, an, uh, an aquarium. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's trying to grab it. Oh, uh, okay. So does he win by disqualification due to the uh, area, <laughs> the fighting area falling apart? And there's glass everywhere. You can't fight on that. This guy's like, oh, fuck. Oh, at least you tried, buddy. He tried. Okay. Oh, he got 
He's cut on the back of his head. Oh, boy. Come on. <laughs> yeah, it does look like Artem Lobov. <laughs> Hi, Spider Zero. This is uh, Rio Heroes, aka Fight Club of Brazil. Like, oh, she's working the camera over there. He's still gonna fight? No, he can't. He's fucked up. He doesn't want to fight anymore. Uh, no contest. It's ruled a no contest. Oh, come on. Is that Oleg Tartarov? Is that the Brazilian version of Oleg Tartarov? He fucking hit the window. That's what he just said. What can he say? He fucking hit the window. He got cut by glass. I win because the glass cut him. Here we go. Some more fighting. Oh, we've seen this guy last time uh, in the previous uh, set of fights. He's the one with the good leg kicks. Whoa, did you see that raging sidekick? That was quite a sidekick. And now they got the guys out front here. Oh, he got fucking rocked. Whoa. I, I wanted to stop it because you notice they put the guys out in front here now to block the no more hitting the fucking flimsy walls and breaking the windows. But he gets fucking, he gets clipped here. Uh, he, maybe he doesn't show it, but he gets fucking rocked. Oh, that hurt. Whoa, spinning shit. This kid's gonna get fucked up by this. Uh, this guy's a good uh, kicker. He's uh, got some skills. Dana White, like I said, Dana White should be fucking going down to Brazil, going down to this shit. If he wants to find some fighters. Oh. Oh. This guy's trying to fucking destroy him. <laughs> Oh. Oh boy. Is the video too late? Can you go to the home? It's gotten pretty loud in my fucking head. He takes him down, he's got his neck. He's choking him out. He's done. He's out. Left. He's tapping out. Yeah, that was a good fight. That was a good fight. This guy looks like he has Down syndrome. He's a good fighter. Here we go. More fights. Non-stop fights. That was, uh, oh, this guy's big. I don't know what kind of choke that was. That was just more of like a, a bully choke. I guess you could call that like a pro wrestling uh, headlock choke. I don't know if there's an official name for a pro wrestling headlock choke, but that's pretty much what it was. He was on sort of the side. The guy was on his knees, and he just uh, sort of choked him out that way. This guy's fucking stretching. He's going to be fighting next. This guy's fucking big. This guy's like six foot five. Jeez. <laughs> A special rules for this? I thought there was no rules. What are you explaining, guy? Your shirt says no rules, so what the fuck are you telling me? What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, was that necessary? <coughs> oh, that's a good kick. Oh, oh, giant motherfucker over here. Yeah, if he can use his kicks, yeah. You, but that was more of a slapping kick. That doesn't really hurt. He's got to get in there with his shin. This guy's big. He's fighting uh, uh, sideways almost here. Oh, spinning back kick there would have hit him right in the head if he connected. That's a good leg kick. Yeah, this guy is fucking huge. He's like, oh, the fucking mat fell apart. And they're fixing it on the fly. No stopping the fight. The ref has moved over there to stop them from potentially going over. 
Uh, oh, he's going for a guillotine here. A tall guillotine. He doesn't have it though. He's just got, he's just sort of holding on to the neck here. He's not choking him. He he's he's trying to choke him. I don't know if the uh uh the woman fight or the I don't know if it's a transgendered woman. Uh, I don't know what the fuck is happening with that. They uh uh Tonka mentioned it on on Twitter, so I don't know if it's in this one or not. Uh, but anyway, this guy he's uh I don't know he doesn't have the like wrapped up the neck. He's got it. The arm is slacked, like, way... But he's really trying to choke. He's not choking him. <laughs> yeah, Josh Barnett. Uh, a Brazil... Dark-haired Josh Barnett. Yeah. <laughs> Now he's got it, like, now it's under, but he's gassing his arms out. He's uh, really gassing his arms out here. He's not He's not getting anything. He should let go of it. Like, abandon the guillotine choke if you ain't got it, like, within the first 15, 20 seconds. Because if you ain't got it by then, it's really tough to pull off after that. Let's stand up. You know who he re reminds me of a little bit? Just his uh, sort of mannerism there? Uh, Wes Sims. Anyone remember that fucking douchebag? Kind of. He looks like his body stance. <laughs> oh, God. He was fucking... Oh, he was doing that hammer? Jeez, he got pissed at that. Oh, he kicked to the stomach. Block that one. This guy's not using his, uh, his size right at all. He should be using his range a lot uh, more. He should be kicking for one thing. He's fighting a southpaw here. And he just ran away. He's running now. He's, uh, oh, he's switching between orthodox and... Uh, oh, God, did you hear that fucking meaty punch? <laughs> what the fuck is happening off camera here? Uh, he, that guy is not using his, his, uh, he should be fighting longer. He should be using more leg kicks for one thing. That's what I'd fucking tell him if I was coaching him. Uh, he's switching from orthodox to southpaw, which is good, but he should, he should stick to fighting southpaw. Is that the camera? <laughs> this is fucking, <laughs> this is fucking troll here. Listen to this meaty sound of this punch. Uh, it, like, uh, if it wasn't all that screaming, that would be like uh, if you're in a sound effects studio and you fucking punch a ham. <laughs> That's the sound that you get. <laughs> oh, he's okay. You better fight, buddy. You're in a fight. You better fight back. Stop running. Fight him. Come on, get him. You look mean. You look mad. Get him. You're in a fight now. Hurt him. Nope. Can't be on the uh, backpedaling. Charge forward. This guy is gross. Fucking done. That's it. This fight's over. Oh, goes for a stomp and now it's over. This guy to be done now. <laughs> oh, God. It all changed for that guy when he uh, he pretty much was running. He didn't want any part of that fight. He get I wouldn't say he's scared, but he uh, he was done engaging. <laughs> he, he kind of wanted out of the fight. He of <laughs> so here's your next. <laughs> yeah, he's got the size. Uh, is that his training partner? The other guy that got his ass kicked. Oh, it's kind of sad.
Hey, everybody. <laughs> oh, boy. I don't know. Uh, uh, hopefully this uh, this reconnects and it all links back up here. <laughs> I'll wait for everybody to come back in here. Just when it was getting good. Just when it was getting good. Uh, OBS fucked me up there. So I don't know what happened. Uh, but when you guys come back in in the chat here, uh, let me know what was the last thing. Yes, we are back. What was the last thing you, you saw? Because uh, I, I was going and I didn't know like it stopped. But I noticed after a certain something that was happening and the chat wasn't responding to what was happening, <laughs> I kind of figured I should check it and see if it was fuck, uh, if uh, the streaming had stopped. And it, it did indeed stop. Uh, so what was the last thing that was uh, before the stream sort of stuttered and stopped what was happening? Uh, let me make sure that that link that I posted, that's still the link. I'm going to check my Twitter real quick here. Let's see. Is, uh, oh, I can check it. Let me just see it here. Oh, God, that fight was way too loud. You can barely hear me. Okay, and I see where the stream kind of fucks up here. All right. Well, I think we have a new... Hey, uh, that's not the right live stream anymore. Hold on, before I continue on here. <coughs> All right, before we continue, I need to get a link for the new stream. Typing into a Firefox address bar okay bear with me folks bear with me I think it's uh, let me uh, just check here uh, can we uh, what the hell just happened oh is it it's let me stop here Oh uh, boy, alright, because I gotta post the link, because I think there's a new link now, because the old live stream hard stopped, so it, sometimes if you have like a fluctuation, like it'll just keep on streaming, uh, let me post this. Okay. So after the, uh, okay, so this guy taps out. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit too. This, this fight was too long. So that fight, uh, this guy obviously wasn't in interested really <laughs> after a certain point in fighting. Uh, could you develop this into a fighter? Or a good fighter? Yeah, possibly, if he learns how to use his size better. Anyway. Alright, so here we go. The much hallibooed. Woman fights a man. <laughs> uh, do you all remember when Ronda Rousey was, was at the top of her game, when she was fighting women who had no business being in the cage with her you know they just weren't on the same level in terms of uh skills and it wasn't until like a uh, holly home came along uh that that was uh, put to an end we all know how that story w went but anyway remember when ronda rousey was at the top of her game and they said oh she could fight a man like ronda could fight uh didn't they say floyd mayweather or some stupid shit like that like ronda uh, you know she could she could take on a guy well, we're about to find out when the Brazilian Ronda Rousey <laughs> literally fights a dude. <laughs> I'm assuming she's the Brazilian Ronda Rousey. Otherwise, why would they have a woman fighting a man? Am I right? Is this still going? Is the chat still going? 
Oh god, it's still going good. Uh, you know what I mean? Wh why would they have this happen? Anyway, let's see what happens. So is there special rules for this? Obviously, the guy just checked his cup, so she's not allowed to attack the groin, which might make it fair. She's ready to fight, though. So how do you think this fight's going to go? <laughs> Let's see. Do you see that? <clears throat> I'll play a little bit more, then I'll go back, and we'll study that in depth. She got good form on those punches, but there's a difference. Um, so that uh, she's clearly just going through the motions here. She's throwing combos, uh, you know, doing. Uh, 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 I fucking I've lost the word in my head. It's gone. Uh, she's doing drills. You know, she's doing a drill that she learned. There's no there's effort in her punching, but there's no conviction. <laughs> There's no conviction at all in her punching, and that, that's a big difference. Notice how he gives her a free shot uh, as we go back here, as I try and... He gives her a free shot, and it doesn't even phase him. He gives her a free shot, it doesn't even hurt him. And that's got to be disheartening. <laughs> this is why women shouldn't fight men. It's not because women... Well, it is because, you know, women just aren't built like a man. <laughs> She actually gets on top and in, in advantage on this uh, position here. She's head biting them here, I think. I guess that's legal. She's sort of brushing her head up against his. Uh, I, I wonder if they're, they're married. And this is uh, marriage counseling <laughs> in Brazil. <laughs> This is what they do in Brazil for marriage counseling. They have them legitimately fight. <laughs> I I hope you're right, Eric. We'll see what happens. If she knees him, a very light knee. She goes for a knee ride. Very light punching there. There is no stank on those punches. Uh, at this point, she's... She's got to realize if this was a fight for her life and you're punching like that, oh my God, there's something bad going to happen. <laughs> there's no, she's got mounts. <laughs> Is that the California kid you're right in favor? <laughs> and she's got to punch him harder, like as hard as she can. <laughs> okay, punch him. He's just toying with you right now. She's headbutting him, but is it hurting? She's fucking, to he's toying with her. He could, he could reverse this position anytime he wants. He's, he's humi humoring her. There's, oh my God, these punches don't hurt at all. Hurt him! Punch him hard! Come on, what is this? This is not real. Those elbows aren't hurting anything. It's... Get in there, ref. Stop the fight. <laughs> the ref, get him in there. <laughs> She's obliterating him. This is horrendous. <laughs> These punches aren't hurting. Now he's just, he's done with it. Now he's going to show you a punch. She's going for a triangle. This is a work. This is a work. <laughs> oh, they're pro wrestling <laughs> working here. <laughs> She's got a triangle. And he's going to tap out. This is a work. Break out of it. Come on. You know at any time he could just explode and get the fuck out of this. This is not. This is, She's gassing her legs out. <laughs> yes Spider Zero has it perfect The indie marks In their horrible punches <laughs> Oh he's gonna slam Oh that hurt He's gonna do it again 
Nope, she lets go smartly. Does she got a bloody mouth? Or is that just her mouth guard? What is she looking at? She's telegraphing where... Look at Amateur mistake number one. <laughs> this, this bitch is all about fucking filming this. <laughs> Amateur mistake number one. Sh uh, she looks where she's going to be striking. She's looking right at the part that she's going <laughs> to... She's looking right at her eye. Zoom. Where is she going to strike here, folks? She's looking right at it. <laughs> Oh, he's got a bloody nose. Look at that. I Wow. How is this possible? <laughs> her husband. Her husband <laughs> is bewildered. <laughs> uh, do ha ha he. Uh, this, is, this is the Brazilian Fight Club, uh, also known as Rio Heroes. Rio Heroes where they, they'll allow women to fight men. <laughs> and this is like a promotion. This is an actual, I guess, was a legit promotion, although we know it wasn't legit. <laughs> How is this possible? <laughs> Look at this. Did he have a razor blade? Was he blading while she was on top and doing uh, flailing her head against him? He had his he did have his hands up above his forehead, you know. You, did you notice? <laughs> did she fight in Bellator? I, exactly, Joey. He bladed. He was blading. <laughs> she shoots in. Uh, he's lost the will to fight. <laughs> <He's>... <laughs> she gets him out again. She's sla lightly slapping ahead. Look at these punches aren't hurting anything. How was she able to cut him? I don't get it. I'm telling you, he bladed. <laughs> <laughs> He's got the razor blade hidden in it. Oh, she's going for an arm bar. Oh, no. Oh, bullshit. This was a fucking work. Come on. You want to know how I know it was a work? Okay, they made it look good. But let's go back to the beginning of the fight here, and I'll go back. Let me uh, get to the beginning here uh, before that. After this, it's so hard to fucking get this right here. A little bit. Okay. Watch how... Watch watch the force at which he kicks her. <laughs> and you know he was probably told to, to stop that. So he gives her a free shot, doesn't do anything. And watch this kick. Boom. That, now see, that was a forceful kick. He doesn't throw a strike for the rest of the fucking fight. Uh, so anyway... Listen, this was a this was a hype this was a hype video for her whatever going into a real promotion. Like, look at she fight a man, she fought a man who who uh, who didn't <laughs> do anything. <laughs> She's a badass. I'll give her that. But that wasn't a real fight. Look at the shit eating grin on this fucking guy. They know it wasn't real. They 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 know. <laughs> Here we go, more fights. This guy looks like a guy I know. Uh, his name is Nacho. <laughs> this is Nacho fighting right here. <laughs> what? What's the rules, ref? Oh, he's got double fist up. This guy. Watch out for this fucking guy. Diego, this is Rio Heroes <laughs> one through four. <laughs> <laughs> no, just wait. We'll get to the actual prison. We'll get to the real prison. This is this is fought in. You missed the glass break. You guys, uh, unfortunately, you come a little late. Uh, one of the fighters flew back and hit one of these glass windows, and the fucking window uh, collapsed, and the guy was cut on his head. Oh my god! Thanks, Alan De Silva. I appreciate that. Anyway, let's keep on watching the fight. <laughs> He's pulling guard here. Nacho. I'm going to call him Nacho because he looks like, like I said, he looks like the guy I know. Nacho's on top. Nacho's punching him. Oh, he gets tripped up to take him down. Oh, the mat's falling apart. <laughs> yes. 
If you win, you win the fight. You won't go. Oh, he's <laughs> stop, stop. You can't. The fucking mats sliding all over the place. Stop. The mat is coming apart. Get in the center of the mat. <laughs> you gotta fight in the center of the mat. He says you can't fight on the fucking outside. Oh, oh. He rocked him. He's got him hurt. Is the video built? Now, see, I was asking. See, this is the problem I had. Last stream, you couldn't hear the video at all. <laughs> now, this time, it's too loud. I'm going to turn it down a little bit here. It is pretty loud. It's loud in my ear, but that's because I'm wearing headphones. This guy is getting fucking demolished. He's done. Oh, my God. Stop the fight, Raph. What are you doing? It's, it's fucking A. He's finally in there. The guy's still going. What the fuck? This guy's got retard rage. <laughs> He's going nuts. He's got emotional problems. He's fucking going crazy. What the fuck happened? What is wrong with this guy? <laughs> He's screaming. <laughs> Let's go back and watch the sequence. This guy's going crazy. He's fucking screaming. You gotta fight on the center. <laughs> he starts fucking killing him here. The guy doesn't want to fight. The ref should stop it as soon as he turns his back. If I was a ref, I'd stop it when he turns his back here. He he turns his back completely. Right there. Stop the fight. That's it. It's over. Stop the fight, ref. Stop it. <laughs> He's killing him. <laughs> He's going crazy now. He's screaming. Oh my god. <laughs> He's screaming. <laughs> wow. That was unnecessary. He's like, You okay? He's like, I just got my ass kicked. He's crying a little bit. I'd be crying too if I got beat like that. <laughs> Ow. That's not nice. Your teeth okay, buddy? Was that a fucking... Uh, was that a grudge match? It, it, maybe he's... <laughs> maybe he slept with the guy's mom. <laughs> you know? <laughs> and the guy <laughs> was so upset. <clears throat> uh, the ref gives him a high five. This guy is fucking... I want to get near this fucking guy. He's nuts. Go say something to the camera. Don't you sleep with my mama! I get you. That's what he's saying. He'll he'll fuck any bitch up that m sleeps with his mama. Damn. <laughs> Damn is right, Spider Zero. Damn. <laughs> All right. Up oh, more real fights. <laughs> Here we go. This guy we've seen before in the Vol Volcan. Uh, the, in the previous, so this must be Rio Heroes number two we're watching. Rio Heroes one took place outside on a street with a, a, the same blue mat, and it was only about six foot, six foot long. <laughs> so we saw this guy fight in the last one. <clears throat> I think it's the same guy. This guy's pretty tall. He looks like he's... I'd, it's hard to judge how tall they are because this guy could be five foot five, and he's, you know, 5'11". So I don't know how tall how tall are people in Brazil usually. I don't know. <laughs> this guy's got the fucking gangster stance here. That's how a gangster stands the fight. Oh, big takedown. Big lift and slam. You see, that, oh, you notice they have the broom here? They had to sweep up the fucking broken glass <laughs> from the one fight that the guy broke the fucking window. <laughs> it's this is apparently a this was a real promotion it was like a legit promotion in brazil uh it's closed up shop now but it was apparently real like and this is it this is how they would have their events look at uh mr fucking uh american apparel over here the fucking uh calvin klein <laughs> whoa 
gets taken down. He's inside control. He's going for punches. Oh, kicks up the fucking math fell apart. Jesus. God, this is pathetic and hilarious and awesome at all at the same time. <laughs> see some punch in here boys oh that was a bitch punch oh that was, uh, wasn't a very good leg kick on second thought this fucking tape on his hand is falling apart oh he winds up there that was bad he gets in side control again this fucking tape on his wrist there is, is he gonna choke him with it what the fuck is happening with this <laughs> these guys are like whoa stop the fight he's tapping out Jesus, ref, do your job. How many guys are wearing camouflage shorts? Oh, the guy got hurt. You hurt him. You, you, you proud of yourself now? Someone's cell phone is going off. Well, okay, that was a fight. This thing's still going. Uh, I gotta keep checking. Oh, no. I don't know. I don't. I think this was 2008. Uh, don't don't be fooled by the flip phones that everybody has. I think Brazil still has those same flip phones today. <laughs> I don't think they have. They have smartphones, but you know, it's like I. Uh, they still have flip phones. <laughs> I'll just say that. Yeah, that's right. All right. All right. So that was the end. I guess I don't know if that was Rio fights one or two. We're on to another Rio fights here. Rio fights three, maybe. I don't know what's happening here, but it, we're in a different location now. <laughs> here we go. More fights. Non-stop fights, all fights all the time. At least they're in a gymnasium this time around. It looks like a legitimate gymnasium uh, with concrete floors. <laughs> whoa, whoa, get, whoa, watch out for the cameraman, boys. At least I got a bigger mat this time, but damn, it's, I'm telling you, you do not want to take a hard slam onto that mat. Those mats don't provide a whole lot of cushion. And that's concrete floors under there. <laughs> Hope he gets in there and hurts him. The guy in the blue, he's looking like he could, uh, he knows how to fight. Uh, the guy with the black trunks, uh, he's just kind of spastic. What is he doing? Good inside leg kick. Oh, he delivers an outside leg kick. That didn't hurt, though. He's right. Oh, knee up the middle. Could have hurt him. This guy in the blue, he's got the confident stance there. He, this other guy, the guy in the black trunks, he's got like a spastic fucking... Look at the, that was sloppy punch. What is he uh, angling his punches like that for? Oh, that was a good leg kick. Oh, nice counter inside leg kick there. He's got on these tight short, uh, shorts. He looks like he's a fighter. Oh, he's baiting him. Oh, me. Work the body. Digs into the body. So I wonder if this guy's fighting next. He looks like he's getting ready to fight. Was it early to mid 2000s? <clears throat> I don't know for sure. I, I could have swore it was. Oh, that kick hurt him. I thought it was 2008, but I, I could be wrong. I don't know for sure. Trying to kick him here. I so I assume kicks to the head of a downed opponent are legal. Get down in there, boy. Just get in there. D nothing stopping you. Get on in there. You should just go for an axe kick. Like, there's the ref. He's like, get the fuck out of here. I'm the ref. Oh, we go for a stomp, but he missed. Oh, he gets reversed. Get in there, cameraman. 
Let's see it. Let's see what's happening. Get a little closer. You, you know, you're not capturing it all. <laughs> Get in closer, ref. <laughs> or I mean, cameraman. <laughs> you're, you're, you, you haven't cut off enough of the action, so just, like, fucking really zoom in. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Whatever happens in the gym. Whoa, they got a fucking sizable crowd for this one. Shit. There was only a handful of. There was like only a smattering of people for the one on the street. Then they went inside, and they had more people. And now they got, they got a pretty legitimate crowd there for this. So this is like the third show. By this time, they were getting traction. Let's go, boys. We're here to fight, not dance. <laughs> what did he do? A fucking like uh, a throat chop there? Nice knee. Oh, he gets kicked in the body. It's pretty good. The fucking bloodlust in the crowd. Whoa, you see this guy? <laughs> Is this his girlfriend? <laughs> oh, flying knee. Doesn't really connect. Oh, he moves in. Oh, he's out in the crowd. Got to go back to the center of the, the mat. <clears throat> I had to clear my throat. What's this guy doing? What are you doing, buddy? Going into business for yourself? Yo, back up, boy. <laughs> what is he there to keep the fighters from going out into the fucking civilian crowd? <laughs> this fuck, go back when the camera goes back to that. <laughs> He's just standing there with his arms straight down. Like, it was a bad fucking uh, capture there, but <laughs> he's just standing like fucking Slender Man. His arms are just straight down. <laughs> <laughs> yes uh, I don't I think the camera uh, it might be a camera woman I think I've seen her uh, shown in a previous uh, real fight here uh, she's not sure what she's doing <laughs> oh well so this guy must be uh, one of the bouncers to keep the fight inside the mat he's got to control that area So, you know, often when, uh, what the fuck is happening? Yeah, I don't know if the police ever come for this shit in Brazil. This is like another day. This is just every day in Brazil. You think the police are going to respond to every call of assault? <laughs> uh, I can sense the guys on uh, the fighters, the other fighters that are on like the other side over here. You can sense that they're getting hyped, that they want to fight, you know. Because you, you get that feeling, you know, especially at the local MMA events that we'd have. You know, you could see, uh, you could feel the uh, the passion rising in the fighters that they want to get out there and fight. I'd want to get out there and fight. If I was on the sidelines, I'd be like, yeah, I want to go out there and I want to fight. Oh, he hurt himself. He's hurt. What happened? This guy's the winner. Are these his fucking trainers here? His brothers? <laughs> he looks a little like Sugar Ray. Uh, Sugar Ray. Oh, the fight started again. Okay. Let's say he looks like Sugar Ray Leonard. Okay, the crowd is barking. <laughs> I could they just stop the fight like that and restart it? The guy's taped his hand. Tape on his hands is falling off. Fucking, don't they know how to put on tape? He just wraps it around. <laughs> yeah, yeah, uh, Bug Beetle has it right. <laughs> you have uh, uh, Shogun Hua getting armed at gunpoint and having his shoes taken. 
<laughs> that's just everyday occurrences. Yeah, I don't think some fighting in a gym. Uh, cops, uh, cops aren't going to respond to that. <laughs> well, this fight is probably one of the longest in the Rio fights series of fights. The Rio heroes. Uh, I'm kind of lost interest in it. We got a long way to go here, boys. We got a long way to go. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to make it that long. I think I might be able to get it around an hour ten because I gotta I gotta skedaddle at around ten o'clock. <laughs> All right, this fight, let's just fast forward a little here. Oh, God, what's happening? <laughs> oh, that's a good little shot. It's like, let's get to the good parts. <laughs> this guy's got mounted. He's going to, he's going to, he's taking over the fight here. My, how the tide has turned. Fortune's changing. <laughs> New heroes are rising. <laughs> All right. How long is this going to go on for here? What happened? Okay, what happened? I fast forward too much, maybe. I can't seem to fucking go back. They're moving the fighters? Okay, how long is this fucking going to go on for? I'm over this fight. Sorry, fight fans. How long does this fight go on for? Holy shit. That guy's got a fucking lump. This, this is a long ass fight. It's still going? Okay, now it's over. Fight fans, <laughs> I had to fast forward this. I was quickly losing interest. And uh, in, the, uh, in the essence of time, in the essence of time, uh, in respect to time, uh, we might have to pick this up at a later date because at around 10 o'clock, which it's 9.30 now, Central Time, uh, I have to uh, do something else. <laughs> so I was hoping to get through most of it, but we had the little issue with the stream ending or the stream stopping, and I should, st I should stop pausing so much. <laughs> Let's get to the next fight. So... Is this a draw? Did nobody win? Jeez. He won? Oh my god. He's got a fucking egg grown out of his head. <laughs> Is that it? Is the stream still up? It's still up. Thank god. There we go. He won. That guy won. Okay. Great. More fights. This guy all right. All right. You, you notice how the camera woman, uh, camera man or camera woman, has corrected their previous mistake of filming into <laughs> the uh, blinding light and now facing the crowd. <laughs> Whoa, he almost fell throwing that kick. Nice inside leg kick. Let's see, boys. Uh, uh, oh, some good one-two there by a guy with the snake on his back. Oh, that was a good inside leg kick from... Uh, uh, I like this guy's trunks. They're kind of dark, like a navy blue with yellow and red. Looks really good. This punch there from uh, uh, that guy. Oh, that was more of a slapping kick. I don't think it had a lot on it. He hit him right in the knee. I couldn't have felt good on his uh, top of his foot there. Soft little punch. That was a good wind up there for like sort of a lunging. What do I call it? Uh, 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 I 
fuck my brain it just died <laughs> I was gonna say like an overhand right kind of it was more of like a, a angular punch coming from the bottom up top good kick there didn't really uh, connect it was mostly blocked these guys uh, are pretending like they want to fight but they're not really fighting that much a good little straight jab there shoots in oh, they hit the wall nope you can't fight over there boys you have to stay inside. He's like, don't touch me. <laughs> you see that? He's like, don't fucking touch me. He's uh, he's worked up. He's uh, in that fight mode. He's like, don't touch me, ref. He, this guy probably has emotional problems. These guys look like they're about five foot two. They're like jockeys. He wants to fight. Come in and fight him. <laughs> yeah, this is how you get your diploma. After, if after you win your uh, Rio Heroes fight, they give you a diploma. Mechanical engineer. <laughs> this guy's good at kicks. Oh, he, oh, they're, now they're egging each other on. Look at that. The shit talking now. Got some shit talking going on. This guy's getting pumped up back here. He's waiting to fight too. These guys are small. These guys have to be small. They have to be like five foot nothing. Well. Are you talking about the, the weirdo kid? <laughs> <laughs> Good kick there. I, I haven't noticed him, but uh, when the camera goes back, I haven't been paying attention. I don't know if... Th I think there's weight classes, I assume, because these two guys are kind of similar size and build. Previous fights, all the guys have been pretty close to each other. Uh, so I assume there's weight classes. Oh, boy. Oh. Well, okay. Are we gonna fight? This is real heroes. Neither one of you are a hero. What are you doing? You were just shit talking each other. Oh, the kid in the back has receded into the crowd. <laughs> it, it, it's Zach Morris. It's it's a chubby Zach Morris. <laughs> what is he doing? Is he? Uh, <laughs> he's like moving his hands, like he's, <laughs> like, uh, he's learning how to fight as we speak. Come on, get in there and fight. Let's see how how long does this go for? Oh my God. Oh, oh boy, he's getting beat up. All right, let's see what happens here. He's bleeding. Fight's still going though. At about the same pace it was before, so what what happened that cut him? <laughs> Silence in the crowd. It's like we're in Japan. <laughs> what did you see with the kid? The pinky's the star of the show. <laughs> I don't think. Well, someone said the the woman that fought the man. <clears throat> Uh, someone said uh, that she was in Bellator I don't know if that's true or not with this kid though this kid in the fucking pink Look, wait, what is he doing like he like bangs his fist into his hand is he is he retarded <laughs> this kid's the star of the show yeah <laughs> He's got his fist up here. He's uh he's learning to fight. <laughs> he's like he's like I'm ready to fight. <laughs> Thanks, negative man. Yes, Rio Heroes. We've we're not gonna be able to get through all of this is Rio Heroes one through four. I'm not gonna be able to get through all of it tonight, unfortunately. Uh started the stream. Uh, I tried to start it earlier, uh, but then we had a hiccup where the stream collapsed, and I had to restart it, so we lost some time there. We lost about 10 minutes 
10 minutes of me talking into nothing and <laughs> and I didn't realize the stream was over and I keep pausing it to ramble on here and this fight I'm about over this fight too the last fight went on way too long the ref is telling him to fucking fight he's telling him they have to fight look at the ref is saying you have to get you have to fight well the guy falls okay let's fast forward here oh my god it's still going on this is this is an eternity for a real fight if it goes longer than five minutes, holy shit, this, uh, now this guy's bleeding. What happened there? Oh my god, what's, what's wrong with his face? Who's eye gouging him? Oh, he gets out of it. Oh, okay, we're back up. Oh my god, it's still going on. Is that it? Is it over? No, it's still going on. What the fuck? This is a marathon. Look at this guy. <laughs> Shorty shorts over here. <laughs> fucking this guy. <laughs> this does look like it's in prison. This could be a fucking uh, uh, in the middle of a prison. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> the All the other fights up to this point were like two minutes long. Including the woman. Uh, well, the woman getting beat up. It, sh uh, it should have been the woman getting beat up. But uh, the guy was... It was a work. Okay, this fight is still going on. Now this guy bleeding more. Why is this fight still going on? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, he finally, let's see how he puts it down. I got to see the finish of the fight here. He's got a forearm choke. <laughs> he gets the mount. All right. What is he doing? He's like, come on. You can't see. The guy's got dirt in his eyes. He's got sweat in his eyes. He can't see. Okay. <laughs> that was anticlimactic. This guy is not done. He wants to. Oh. <clears throat> he wants to fight some more, I guess. You've been fighting for like 25 minutes. It's over. Thank God. <laughs> he sounds like a midget. That's cute. <laughs> he sounds like a midget too. Oh my God, that's so cute. That's so cute. They're like the, uh, what do you call them? Uh, little uh, uh, guys from um, Wizard of Oz. The lollipop man. I'm the lollipop man. <laughs> it's good to go back. That's so cute. These guys look like they're about five foot. And now, <laughs> now it's confirmed that they're five foot. <laughs> it's the lollipop guild. <laughs> Here he comes. <laughs> That's cute. All right, more fights. Here we go. Yeah, this fucking guy over here. Holy shit. <laughs> He's just big and awkward. <laughs> He's got a body lock. He's going to lift and take him down. Nice. He's turning to get out of it. He's turning into him. Now he's turning up to his knees. Nicely done. He's going to stand. Good job. He goes for an elbow. Misses. He's going to get slammed again here, I think. Nope, he's tripped down. Guy jumps over to side control. This guy in red, I don't know if he knows how to fight. Uh, the guy in the camo, light camo colored trunks here. Uh, he knows how to fight, I would say. But this guy in the red, this doofus looking fucker. I don't know if he knows how to fight. He's grabbing the shorts. Is that legal in Rio Heroes? He spins around. Knee him. <laughs> No, I have to download it. Oh, do you see that? Oh, holy shit. I, I called it. I said, this guy don't know how to fight. Damning proof. This fucking punch right here. I got to download Rising. I got to watch it. Someone said there's a lot of works or a lot of fake fights on it. This fight. He's not even looking at. The, he's not even looking. Where is he punching? He, uh, he's side looking at him. He's, he's like, I see ya. I see ya. <laughs> he fucking punches behind him. 
Oh, God help me. Nope, the guy in the, the sort of camo trunks is back on top of her. He's trying to spin. He's spinning to nowhere, <laughs> as I like to say. Oh, he's in mount. What? What do you? What happened? What is happening? What's happening? Did he fart? Did he shit himself? Oh, he hurt his knee. He's got a cramp. He's got a cramp. He's like, I don't want to stop fighting. It's just a cramp. Oh my God! This this ver this part of Rio fights here. This must be Rio fights three, the previous one in the office, and then the one out on the street. That was Rio fights two and one. So this is Rio fights three. I think we figured it out. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. I gotta download that and check it out, and maybe I'll do a mini review of it. Up. Oh, this guy's hurt. He can barely walk. He's got a cramp. He needs more uh, liquids. Oh my god. This guy's all sweaty. What the fuck? Is this uh, Lampanella's son? Okay, uh, well, okay, that was fucking great, dude. <laughs> All right, so we have, uh, who's, uh, who does this remind me of? Oh, look at that leg kick. This guy is fighting in a shirt. Uh, this guy kind of looks like, uh, oh my God, it's uh, Rich Franklin. That's who, I, that's who I thought it looked like. We'll see, does it look like Rich Franklin or not, fight fans? You tell me. Rich Franklin. <laughs> yes or no? <laughs> <laughs> a Brazilian Rich Franklin <laughs> So Rich Franklin is on top And listen I don't know this guy's name So I'm just going to fucking go with it Rich Franklin's on top here Against the uh, guy in the shirt <laughs> Yes I don't know if bananas help Do ban bananas help w with cramping What is this guy doing <laughs> this guy in his street clothes dirty feet gross yes Jake Shields ah that's what I was thinking of Jake Shields <laughs> I was thinking of Jake Shields actually uh, but uh, Rick Frank uh, Rich Franklin also came to mind Well, is this the last fight of Rio Heroes 3? And I think Rio Heroes 4 is after this, and it takes place in like a jail. Like, no shit. <laughs> what was he walking around in shit before the fight? <laughs> how does this guy have perfectly clean feet? I mean, look at how white this guy's feet are. Uh, compared to this, what is the difference here? This guy obviously had shoes and socks on. <laughs> is this, uh, this guy looks like Rose, uh, what's his name? Uh, someone help me out here. Rose's husband, uh, used to be a heavyweight fighter in UFC, had that huge, uh, a uh, reversal against Czech Congo, was it? Uh, what's his fucking name? That's him right there. Uh, we we found him. <laughs> what's his name? Somebody in chat knows it. <laughs> Somebody, come on. I'm waiting. Somebody in, in the chat knows who I'm talking about. Pat Barry, yes. <laughs> This guy looks like Pat Perry. 
Thank, thank you, both uh, culturally unriched and negative man. I appreciate it. <clears throat> Pat Barry. So we got uh, Jake Shields and Pat Barry here. Oh, that's a good knee there by Jake Shields. Pat Barry's hurt. Oh, he gets elbowed. He's hurt. He doesn't want any more. Pat Barry's done fighting. Get in there, ref. Stop the fight. Pat Barry's he's waving it off. Pat Barry's waving it off. Jake Shields uh, slash Rich Franklin has won. What's happening? The fuck is going on over here? Why is he upset? What, he can't elbow to the back of the head? Hello, the uh, ref's t-shirt says no rules, Bushido. Rio Heroes on the back, it says no rules on the front. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's possible. I mean, you look at Rose, honestly, just the way she talks and the way she acts, she looks like she has some, like, emotional problems. Uh, just the look on her face, she's got like permanent resting bitch face, you know, like, like just like this scowl on her face. Uh, she, she's a good fighter. Uh, she might be a, a great person, but uh, she looks like she has some emotional issues. And if Pat Barry was dating her at 15 and he was in his late twenties, yeah, that might, that might do it. That might leave some emotional scarring. <laughs> Uh, and in fact, if she was willing to do that, if she's 15 dating a late 20 year old man, uh, you know, it, maybe there's some other stuff that happened to her when she was younger. Uh, I'm j I don't know for sure, but <laughs> see, it says no rules, no rules. It says on the front of the shirts, buddy, Rio heroes on the back, no rules on the front. There you go. Uh, Jake Shields. Uh, there goes Pat Barry. See ya, Pat. <laughs> Jake Shields <laughs> is the winner. No rules. This other guy was upset. Wow. All right. Whoa. Whoa. Where did this fucking guy come from? <laughs> is he in the right country? <laughs> Oh boy. All right. All right. More Rio Heroes 3 here. Look at this gremlin looking motherfucker. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I would, I would guess, I don't know if she's ever come out and said uh, anything about that negative man, but I get that feeling, you know, I just get that sense. Uh, and I'm not saying Pat Berry caused, you know, any of that. Maybe he helped her. Maybe he's a great, you know, uh, uh, part of her life you know great influence but you know i get she kind of go oh, she's kind of uh, it, it's hard to place it just her mannerisms and the way she acts <laughs> are you, you you're saying you don't care if it was possibility that she was 15 and he was in his late 20s uh deja uh do ha ha he Are you saying the topic is not of interest to you? <laughs> or are you saying that that's a topic that should not be discussed? It's none of our business? I mean, I, I could see that point of view, if that's your point of view. But anyway, I'm just chatting. I'm just chatting. <clears throat> it doesn't really matter in the end. Who cares? So they both have yellowish trunks on here. This guy looks like he's fucking shit his pants. What the fuck is going on in the back? <laughs> I, I don't know how to pronounce your name. It's uh, ha ha he because <laughs> that's I look at that and I think at the uh, <laughs> I think that's the uh, uh, Spanish ha ha he. So I don't know. Maybe it's do ja ja ji. <laughs> All right, we'll get back to the fights. It's something to discuss, though. Something to talk in uh, the background of the, uh, the fights. Because, listen, there's not much to talk about. <laughs> Other than the, how dirty this fucking guy's shorts were. <laughs> and the guy in the pink shirt, which I think that's him right there. <laughs> right here. 
Oh, okay. Well, the only reason I said that is not because I thought you were Spanish, but that's how uh, that's how Spanish people write laughing. Like if they're doing laughing instead of ha ha, they do ja ja, or is it ha ha but with J's? Anyway, moving on. <laughs> This, I am assuming, is the last fight of Rio Heroes number three. And then right after this, we'll go into Rio Fights number four. But we'll have to put a stop to it there and maybe catch up on Rio Fights number four later. Whoa, you're throwing a firebomb there, Eric. No need to... Whoa, you see, almost kicked him in the face there. Oh, I thought this guy was the guy in the pink shirt. He's over there. <laughs> oh, let's not get let's not get a uh, no no need to argue in the chat. We're all friends, friends and loved ones. We're all of us friends and loved ones here. <laughs> let's take down by other yellow shorts, lighter yellow shorts. What, what kind of yellow would you call that? Is that a soft yellow and the guy other guy has a school bus orange or school bus yellow shorts well this fight is another <laughs> yes if only that fight if that kick would have landed it probably would have ended this fight so this fight is another one that's going uh, the way of uh, boring sort of fights. This uh, this third ver this third entry in the Rio Hero series hasn't been that good. Rio Heroes one was great, uh, ten out of ten. Rio Heroes two was even better, if you could believe that. That was eleven out of ten, just because the guy broke the glass and there was a woman fighting a man. Uh, this Rio Heroes three though here, this one has generally sucked uh, but assuming that so Rio Heroes 3 has taken up the vast majority oh there's the, a woman cameraman get out of the way Rio Heroes 3 has sort of taken up about 40 minutes of our boring gold yeah mustard sort of like, yeah it does kind of look like a mustard I would call it mustard Rio Heroes 3 has taken up about 40 minutes of our fight card here of our fight time so I assume Rio Heroes 4 is going to take up this last little bit here. So that means it should be good. That means the fights are quick. You guys choked out. Get in there, ref. Stop the fight. Oh, he's punching. He's fighting it off. Nope, he's going to sleep. Let's see. Yes, yes. So this whole, f uh, this whole video file here, a Negative Man, has Rio fights 1 through 4. Uh, and I'll remember, I think this is, I assume this is the last fight of Rio Heroes 3. And we'll, we'll go back and we'll recap here. Let's, let's fast forward here. Oh God, we have one more fight. All right, we're going to get through this fight and that will be the last one I can do. But before we get there, let's, uh, let me remember where we're at here. We're at about 20, 126. So Heroes Rio fights number one <laughs> out in the street. This is Rio fights number one. Uh, I don't know how the stream is going to be if it's uh, it might be in two parts because uh, the screen uh, the stream crashed as we started Rio Heroes. Uh, no, we're, while we're inside Rio Heroes number two. So here's Rio Heroes number one. Rio Heroes number two was inside the office. Oh, in fact, we can replay <laughs> just for those who haven't seen it. Uh, the glass uh, window breaking. It's pretty close here. I think it's pretty close. You know how? Ooh, look at that punch! There it goes! Oh! <laughs> uh, okay, let's go back. Let's watch this last fight here. I'm assuming, yeah, okay, because here's the prison. <laughs> they moved. Re so real fights four is in a prison, <laughs> in a correctional facility. Uh, so real fights three ends here. This is the last fight. We'll watch that, and then we'll have to call it a night fight fans 
All right, here we go. We've got Abdullah the Butcher versus another Abdullah the Butcher. Uh, Abdullah the Butcher's child. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it was a stage fatality. <laughs> Oh, did you see that raging punch there? This guy, he's got on communist trunks. No, they're just Muay Thai trunks. <laughs> oh, he punched him right in the face. What's happening? What? What is the cameraman saying? Yeah, I did like the exterior of the, the parking lot. But you know what I like about Rio fights is that they're, they're really di diverse in their locations. Uh, they have them uh, all over the place. Well, the guy in the pink is still there. He's still fucking intently watching these. <laughs> oh, he hurt himself. He, he's hurt his... Oh, he's hurt. That's it. He. Oh, he can't walk. Oh, my God. That's it. Fight's over. Unless they're going to restart it. Is he walking it off? You can't just stop the fight. Hold on. What kind of promotion is this? They just randomly stopped the fight. The guy walked it off. Now this guy's got a target. He knows where to hit or where to kick. Kick him in his uh, dopey leg there. <laughs> he, might, he might have hepatitis C. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, he kicks him. He's kicking the wrong leg, though. He's got to kick the other one. <laughs> yeah, this is Brazilian. <laughs> Which, I don't know if you'd want any of these guys bleeding on you. Uh, honestly. I don't know how pervasive bloodborne illnesses are in Brazil. Uh, so I'm only commenting from an ignorant American stance. Uh, but I wouldn't want any of these guys bleeding on me. You know, you can, you can say what you say if you want them bleeding on you. <laughs> okay, but I'll just... Oh, he jumps up there for a guillotine and... Uh, this, this is a big boy. <laughs> oh, you, are you talking... Uh, <laughs> did that really... I mean, I know uh, Fedor's mafia brother fought uh, Jeff Munson, but uh, did he have uh, infected blood with hepatitis C? I didn't know that. Jeez. <laughs> I, did, would they? How would they allow that fight to happen? Did they know he had hepatitis C at the time? Anyway. <clears throat> His mouth is just filling up with the hepatitis C blood. <laughs> He's gurgling it. <laughs> oh, boy. How is that? How did that fight go on? If that was, if <laughs> wouldn't they have not allow allow him to fight with? Uh, that's like uh, Bob Orton. Who did he fight? Who did Bob Orton fight? Undertaker. I hope he's going for an American or a Kimura. He gets out of it though. Uh, didn't Undertaker like nearly kill Bob Orton or was like really pissed off at him that he was bleeding? <laughs> Cowboy Bob Orton and his hepatitis <laughs> getting on the Undertaker. Oh, is it is it over? <laughs> Thanks, El El Bugbito. <laughs> That's it. The fight's over. Oh, that guy's got a bad case of herpes. <laughs> the worst case of of oral herp herpes I've ever seen. 
Oh, he got hurt in the head. He hurt his head. So there you go, Abdullah the Butcher, uh, his son. <laughs> all right, there we go. That was all right. So that was clear. <laughs> Look at this. What is this? Are they for real? What is this? They ramped the fucking uh, up the slopes of the cage. So here we go. Uh, this is Rio Heroes Four. We won't be able to watch it, fight fans. Unfortunately, uh, I have got to go. We've uh, we've run a little late here, so uh, I'm actually gonna check and see if I have. Uh, I think I have OBS set to save to record the videos at the same time it's streaming. So what I'll do is instead of uh, instead of publishing the two streams, I'm assuming they're going to be two separate streams, the one that before the crash. Uh, I'm going to actually join those together and I'll probably upload them later. So Negative Man, you can you can check it out later. Uh, but yeah, this will be the end of uh, the stream tonight, uh, Fight Fans. I'll do better next time. <laughs> this, this week was kind of... Uh, uh, kind of shitty, uh, but next week will be better. But uh, hey, some channel updates for those who care. Uh, the Rings Review series uh, will be up very soon uh, in the next couple days. And then I'm going to get right uh, right after that, I'm going to get directly started on Pride Resurrection, the next episode. Uh, Pride Resurrection review of The Best, Volume 1. Pride, The Best, Volume 1. That should be a good one. Don't think... Good Vibes is going to be in on that one, but he's for sure uh, definitely going to be coming back for uh, Bad Blood, which will be the next Pride after the shit show that is the best. So, good night, everybody. Thanks for coming. Thanks for watching, uh, and I'll see you guys later.